Hi, this is Dina with Digital Hotcakes, and we're in Pro Show Producer today, and I'm going to show you how to create this neat video effect where we have our video inside a vignette with a moving background displaying in the back. First, let me go ahead and get rid of this slide so we can start from scratch. The first thing you'll want to do is bring in your your video clip. Just drag and drop it to the to the slide. Of course, we got to wait for it to to get to download in there. Okay, now I have my video. Let's double click on the slide to open slide options. And the first thing I want to do with this is set the slide time to the length of my video. And you do this under video settings, video clip settings. Right here it says slide time, lock slide time to video link. So we're going to select that. Okay, next we want to we want to put the video inside the vignette. So let's go over to layer settings. And we're going to choose add, add a layer. And what we want to add here is a masking layer and we want to add a vignette. So when this when the vignette box comes up here you're going to want to put the shape as ellipse and we want it to be transparent because we want to see through the vignette. Click OK. Okay now as you can see this vignette is way too big so we want to size it down to where um, it's just capturing the piece of video or the, the size of the video that we want to see. So let's click on the vignette and you can use your scroll mouse button to make to make this bigger or smaller. I'm just using the scroll on my mouse. So I that's that looks about good. And you can also if you wanted to move this vignette just grab it with your mouse and you can move it like this. But I think it looks good right there, maybe just a little bit smaller. Okay. All right, so now we're done with that. We need to add our background. So here we go. We choose the Add button, Add Image or Video. And here's our Champagne Parade background. This Champagne Parade background can be found on Digital Hot Cakes Wedding Essentials Volume Number 3 or Wedding Essentials Volume Number 1 in HD. So we're going to bring this in, and I'm actually using the HD version. And what we want to do here um, to this background is just make it a little more um, subtle, kind of dreamy looking. And we can do this by going under the, go under your slide tab, and under the background tab here, and up here under background type, we want to check this box that says override show background for this slide. And then we want to set our color here to white. Easiest way to do that is just grab your little eyedropper here and drop it in the white. And then choose set color. Okay. And then we're going to go back under layers, under editing, and we're going to make sure that this Champagne Parade layer is selected and we're going to reduce its opacity to probably about 75%. Let's just type that in there, 75%. And as you can see, that kind of made this a little lighter, a little more dreamy looking. Okay, so now we've got to make sure that our vignette is cut out of this background. So the easiest way to do that, since we already built our vignette, we got it the size that we want it to be, we're just going to copy this layer. And you can do that by right-clicking on that layer, and it says duplicate, dupl duplicate layer. Just go ahead and select that. And you see it put us a new vignette layer up here at the top. And the only thing we're going to need to do to edit is make it a masking layer. Again, we're going to right click on that. We're going to say use, use as a masking layer. And as you can see now, now it's a masking layer. However, we want our background on the outside. We don't want it on the inside here. So we're going to have to set this mask to, let's go to layer settings. And under masking layer here, there's an invert right here. We just want to click we want to click this box right there. And there we go. Now we have our 
our backgrounds in the background and our video still in the middle and we are finished. Let's see what this looks like. There you go. Pretty simple and a pretty cool effect.